All right. Who? Is that all of them? Hector, where did you come from? From heaven. No. Well met, Elliewood. Yes, but what are you doing here? Wow, Elliewood, can't you just say hi to a friend? <laughs> you wound me. How do you mean? What is this dialogue? <laughs> You're looking for your father, right? Why didn't you send word? Your brother was just named Marquez Ostia. What is that typo of a name? Ostia? Ostia. He's going to be very busy setting up his court council. Lord Uther must need your support. You are his brother, after all. My brother is not so weak. Oh, he has mentioned some things in public, but... He knew exactly what I was planning, and he let me go. Is that so? Well then, it would be unwise to refuse his kindness. It does me good to see you, Hector. Thank you. Think nothing of it. You know Oswin, don't you? Well met, Lord Elliwood. It is good to see you again, Oswin. So you came as well? Yes, Lord Uther was worried about Lord Hector traveling alone. I've been ordered to keep a close eye on him. <laughs> of course, good to have you with us. Lord Hector, why didn't you tell me the fighting was done? I apologize for an interruption. I couldn't restrain her any longer. <laughs> Are these your companions, Hector? Oh, yes, I suppose they are. <laughs> when you're ashamed of your friends. One might have hoped for better, but... That was uncalled for. I can't believe you said that. Matthew, did you hear what he said about you? <laughs> Me? He was talking about you. Hector, why don't you introduce us? The noisy one is Sarah. Believe it or not, she's a cleric. Yes, I am Sarah, my lord. Pleased to meet you. And that's Matthew. He does a lot of sneaking around. <laughs> Just... <laughs> my lord. Sneaking around. Well, I uh, gather information, open doors, chests, and stuff. I've got a nimble fingers. <laughs> I love how everyone's embarrassed to just say that he's a thief. He's a thief. Just say he's a thief. <laughs> a thief for hire, if you want to make it sound nicer. But, speaking of... That sounds like a thief's work. Well, don't let it worry you. But this journey, I suspect it will be harder than you imagine. You may have to accept things like this if you want to survive. What is it, Hector? Do you know something? Nothing specific. Rumors abound, though. A league of assassins from Biran... Biran? Biran? Biran. Has been moving around in Lycia. Experienced bounty hunters and mercenaries are vanishing. That reminds me. One of the men who attacked us said something odd. What was it? Lord Elliwood, if I may. Marcus, good to see you. Lord Hector, it's been far too long. Your assistance is greatly appreciated. Come now, Marcus, no need for such formalities. Tell me what you heard. Of course. The apparent leader of that gang of thugs. He indicated that someone was watching Lord Elliwood. That someone needed him dead. Hmm, that is troubling. Actually, the captain of the guard was watching the fight when we arrived. He was a knight of Santa Cruz, and yet he just stood there and let a lord be attacked. I think he was planning on seeing you die. Oh!
sorry, I was reading through the chat. So, Nom Nom, what do you think? You might be right. I don't know. And what am I right about? Something may have happened to Lord Hellman too. Oh, yeah. I was totally thinking that. As yes, I was totally thinking that. <laughs> Come, we must hurry to the castle. <laughs> Hollywood, who is this? Oh, it's so weird when the sprite looks directly at you. Like, player you. Or, yeah. Ah! <laughs> this is Nom Nom. I require tactical aid in the search for my father, and... Oh, I see. So this is who directed the battle plan back there, hmm? You know, Nom Nom, you're very young. Uh, yeah. We've many strategists in Ostia, but none so young. Elric, are you sure about this one? Um... You probably should not be sure about me. <laughs> Nom Nom is still a student of military strategy, but... We've received nothing but sound advice so far. Nom Nom has my trust. Alright, I suppose I shall witness your skills firsthand. Well met, Nom Nom. Well met. Matthew! My BFF! What's up? Hello! How have you been, Nom Nom? Eh? My secret's revealed. Oh, that. Yes, it's true. My guys, it's a common thief with butteroos. I've served House Ostia for some time as a spy of sorts. Surprise? Well, regardless, it looks like we'll be traveling together again. Here's to our mutual survival. Hey! Oh lord, I don't know if I could do this with my dying voice. <laughs> nom nom, is that. Is it really you? It's been far, far too long. You missed me, didn't you? Of course you did. I knew it. It's okay, Sarah. I did miss you. Hmm? Didn't I tell you before? I'm in the employ of Ostia, BCS ruling territory. I'll be here to help you just like before. Aren't you lucky? <sighs> uh, I wish her voice was better in Fire Emblem Heroes. I always get kind of disappointed whenever I hear her <laughs> in that game. Alright, moving on. Eliwood enters Santa Cruz, only to be attacked by a strange group. In a desperate moment, he is rescued by a childhood friend, Marquez Ostia's younger brother, Hector. The assailant's leader reveals that an unknown party seeks Eliwood's head. Eliwood cannot help but think this is related to his father's disappearance. In search of more traces of his father's footsteps, Eliwood sets out for the castle of Lord Helmut, the Marquez of Santa Cruz. Okay, so now this is the chapter where Lord Hellman is stupid. And, yeah. Chapter 13. Chapter. Those things chapters have sounded pretty nice, but that one just seems too straightforward, I think. I don't know. Whew. Master Ephidel! What is the meaning of this? Peace, Lord Hellman. Whatever is wrong. You said you were just going to frighten Nellywood. Your men almost killed him. My patience is at an end. I've decided I must tell Nellywood everything and apologize. Literally, there's the line that gets him killed. That's I always got so frustrated with him. I know plot, story, sadness, whatever, but hmm. <laughs> oh. You would betray us? I am tired of you and the black thing. Now, remove yourself from my castle. Your presence pains me. Lord Hellman, 
Is there nothing I can do to change your mind? Nothing. In that case, you're no longer of any use. What? Gah! Erg! Oh! Who could have seen that coming? There's the castle, Ellywood. We have to speak with Lord Hellman. That's not gonna happen, laddie. Who are you? Ah, computer. Rude. I don't want your notifications. Who am I? Oh boy, you'd do better to worry about yourself. You'll be worm speed before much longer. You think so? I think my axe will challenge her. Change your mind. Wow, why I say challenge? <laughs> change your mind. Ha! The cub thinks he's a wolf. Does your bite match your bark? Tell you what, if you make it to the castle alive, we'll find out, eh? <laughs> Guy! <laughs> oh, this babe, this baby. Oh, this baby. All right. <laughs> hey, you. Yeah, the new dog. Get this right, or you're gone. I know, I know. I just got this job. I don't want to lose it. Of course, the smart thing to do would have been not to get involved with this ugly bunch. Gotta have gold if I want to eat, though. I was too picky before. But think about the time I passed out in Kaelin. Ugh. Nothing funny about that. That man. What was his name? Matthew? <gasps> Another new game mechanic being introduced? If it hadn't been for him, I would have starved to death. What are you mumbling about? Get over here now. Yes, yes, I'm coming. At least I've got work. <laughs> hmm, I wonder who you recruited him with. Gee, I don't know. Could be anybody, really. Ugh. Nice to be working with you, Nam Nam. As a journeyman knight of Frey, I'm here to serve Lord Hollywood and you, Nam Nam. I await your command. It's kinda late to give me that introduction, Lowen. <laughs> like. Well, eh. I guess he just got excited. Yeah, Elliewood does not get the best life. Just too much bad stuff happens. Oh shoot, that's right. The log mechanic. Mm. I think. Mm. I'll send. Marcus over there. And I guess Bartray could tag along. I mean, not that Marcus needs the help, but I don't know. Make it less cluttered, I guess, over here. Or actually, you know what? Take Dorcas. You go as well. If you value your lives, stay clear of the castle southwest of here. There's a swordsman named Guy. He's young, but deadly. He carries a killing edge, a fearful sword to be sure. I'm warning you, find another road to the castle. Mm. No, it's okay. We got this. Cause I remember what we gotta do. We gotta do things. <laughs>
merchant just went running past here in a panic. He dropped some things. I tried to tell him, but it looked like he's the sort that drops things a lot. That's kind of bad for a merchant to be doing that. Oh! I did forget to make a safe state! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> no, it will not be fine! Oh no! I done effed up already! <laughs> I always forget to do that. <laughs> I don't care if she's dead weight. I am not accepting this. No, we're going back. <laughs> Hold up. I might have messed up some things. There we go. <laughs> Just... <laughs> you do have great timing. <laughs> so that didn't happen. Wait, can I skip this? I can. Okay. I didn't know if I could skip this or not. <laughs> Acceptable casualties. I I can't. My heart will not let me let anyone die. I don't care if they suck. I can't let people die. Okay. So we're gonna do the stuff that doesn't require me to scum save. Yep. Yep. At least I don't need to visit the houses anymore. That's done. It's like I had deja vu about something. Okay. Well, I don't need to technically sc scum safe with Lor Lowen. Why do I? Lowen? Yes. But, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> Hi. How's it going? Yeah. Yeah, there's been very few times where I've just gotten so frustrated where I was like, okay, fine, I'll let this one person who I vaguely don't care about die. But most of the time, I will try very hard before I reach that point. It's gonna get kind of cluttered. Um, well, no, actually. Uh. <sighs> you go there. No. Yes. No. Ugh. Rebecca, you just hang back there. I don't trust you right now. Wow, what a different outcome. I mean, wow, look how great it's going the first time around without me needing to restart at all. I'm amazing. <laughs> I'm a great tactician that everyone can trust. <laughs> Alright. Proceed from there. Okay. I probably should have seen that coming. 
But it's okay. I am not disheartened. She can't reach that other one. Darn, that would've been a perfect killing target. Um, that's okay. She can come kill this one maybe, possibly, if she doesn't miss. So honestly, I don't know if I'm gonna keep her around for super long. Right now, she's kinda needed. Well, Needed is a very, very loose term I use here. <laughs> of course not. Oh, at least she dodged. Could have been a worse case. Still triple Matthew. Oh yeah, Pent's wife. Oh Louise. I love her. She's great. Um, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, Hector. Oh, <laughs> oof. I'm definitely gonna save. Oof. Wait. What is this? Two chances to hit? What? What? Oh my, she was right there! Oh, uh, is there else? No, it's not Oh, it's not I think, what level are you at? Right? Five, but thieves are kind of... A week, a week. You, you do it. A step, a step. Okay. <laughs> I need to trash talk these characters in order for them to actually do their job. That's what that double hit was about. I believe it. <laughs> uh, uh, wait. Yeah. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> this dude. This will never do. Look at the time. I must leave for Kayla now, or my business will be ruined. Time is money, after all. Hurry, hurry, rush, rush, rush. Totally like the rabbit, um, you know, so underland. <laughs> but greedier. <laughs> huh? What's this? That man must have dropped it. A torch. Gee, I wonder if that will be convenient in a later chapter. Mm -hmm. 
Tick to Oh, Marcus. Don't have to bully these bandits like that. <laughs> they know nothing. Alright. So, this is where things get slightly dicey. But we will hopefully make it okay. Ah, what good timing. Would you like to try this for me? It's an invention of a great witch. Me. It's a mine. It contains some very explosive magic. Hide it on the ground and when an enemy steps on it... Kaboom! Hee hee hee. I'm still tasking them, so that one's free. Come back and tell me how it works. And then you use this so you can get close to Matt, uh, not Matthew, Guy, without dying. And, uh, shoot. Yeah, that's gonna be a little dicey. But it will be okay. to make it work. Dang! Not only did he dodge, but he critted the heck of that archer. And look at that solid level up! Barcher, you continue to a maze. Sarah's fine. Sarah's fine. <laughs> Oswin! Oh! Pfft. Pfft. Concern is nowhere when it comes to Oswin. Okay. So, yeah. This is gonna continue to get a little dicey. Depending how these next couple of turns or moves go. <laughs> All right, let's. Uh, oof, oof. It's just like they're dancing around these bandits. Like, nope, can't touch me. Level up. 
Yay! Okay, okay. Yeah, I'll accept those. Pew pew! Alright, stabby stabby. One thing that I do see after about the. Oh, wait, level up. Okay. Still no strength for Matthew. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Poor Matthew. Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, one thing I do gotta say about newer games when it comes to combat animations is that I do like how they sort of become more fluid. Like with the GBA games, like with Loan for example, you just hit, go back, and then go in and hit again. Whereas like with the newer games, if they hit, get to hit twice in a row, they go up and they hit twice in a row. Which is really cool. And I do appreciate that kind of changes in the newer games. But I don't know. Still something about the classic that I can never get over fully. <laughs> so, I ain't going near you. Which is cool. Um, I am going to move you here. I'm gonna move you over there. And you stay there, boo boo. And you go there. Do I need anything in the front I don't know if I do. Do I? I mean, I guess javelins are nice, but, and maybe I have a hand axe for Dorcas, but, eh. I think I'll leave it for now. I'm sure later on I'll want to pay more, pay more attention shopping-wise, but. Rebecca, sit. Oh, it is so solid. I appreciate him. I think I took him for granted, normally. But so far, I really appreciate him. Boom! Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Marcus, it's been a while. You got it? Solid, perfect kill of 21 hit points to 21 health points. Oh, okay. It's okay. Bar trade doubling? Yeah, I don't know. I am starting to question if my game is actually broken. I don't know. I don't. I didn't do anything to it. I didn't. No patches or weird downloads or anything. So I don't know. I'm starting to question things though. Okay. I need to eventually get him down there. <laughs> I just. I hate it because there's these two here who are just hanging out and refuse to move, and it bothers me. Oh, I think I know how to fix that though. Gradual process. Oh. Oswin. <laughs> A boo. Wanna maybe? No, actually, I need to get him down there. But 
but I need to clear those two up first, so. Weapon level increase. Nice, nice. Another double for Bartre. I might actually like him better as than Dorcas. Not on a character level, but on a fighting level. So far, he has amazed me. I'm not gonna fight the boss yet, because I really need... Well, the point is to see his gate anyway, so I guess it will be fine. Let me save just in case. I'm paranoid about these things. I still need to get that guy. But since the goal of the game is, to, or this chapter is to seize the gate, it should be fine. What's this? You've made it this far? Ah, I paid too much for that worthless pack of cell swords. Ha! <laughs> You're not wrong. I mainly say better than Dorcas um, because of like, like comparing the classes. If we were to start comparing Bartre to other units in general, ha 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 ha. Oh shoot, Marcus, I didn't realize you were getting so close. I'm sorry, but boy, I'm sorry. But you're fine, you won. Hey, would you look at that? You've beaten me, but you're too late to save him. Too, too bad, eh, laddie? Gah, <laughs> <laughs> oh no! Oh no! But hey, a level up! <laughs> okay. On time. Okay, guy doesn't move. Good. Alright, I think we can finally move on to recruitment phase. Uh, level up in the meantime. Boop, boop. Okay. Like, pretty much as soon as we recruit him, it's... Oh, wait, no. It's not going to be over. That's right. He's got to seize the gate still. That's why we're still here. No? There we go. Okay. So, phase two of recruit... Or, no, phase one of... No. Phase two. Phase two of recruitment. And now... We wait. I miss little details like this in the newer games, though. Ah, 
I get this straight up steal from him. And I almost attacked him, which good thing I didn't. <laughs> Talk. A guy. Hold on, you. I know you. Isn't your name Guy? It's... Is that you, Matthew? What a pleasant surprise! How's your sword work coming? You are aware this isn't the best place to be catching up, aren't you? You and I, we're on opposite sides here. You're literally the only one left in your party, Guy. This... <laughs> what? Are you saying you're going to fight me? I... Well, yeah, I'm much improved. You can't beat me. You're quite a terror, guy. Well then. Hold on. I think I'd prefer it if you repaid what you owe me. Huh? Last time I saw you, I gave you food. If I remember correctly, you said you owed me your life. I only said that because you said you said you'd feed me if I did. <laughs> I hadn't eaten in 10 days, and you are cooking me! You... this... this isn't fair! The people of Sakai never lie. Isn't that right, guy? <sighs> Fine! I finally find work, and now I have to throw it away. This is all your fault. It's okay, guy. It's for the better. Just a couple awkward turns of me getting Elliewood up here. Don't worry about it. Marcus me. Oh wait, I didn't visit this house. Oops. Your group moves like lightning. You must have an expert tactician giving you direction. <laughs> yes, they do. <laughs> I'd love to study under someone like that. Oh, that's literally... Okay, cool. I complimented. How nice boost my ego a little. Seize that gate. Now deep plot continues. Lord Hellman! Is that you, Elliewood? Hold on, my lord. I... I must apologize. Your father. He... Do you know something, sir? I... If I hadn't told Elbert about... Darwin's plans. This would never have. This would. Oh, I already read that line. Cough, cough. Lord Hellman! Go to Laos. Darwin. The Marquis of Laos knows all. Marquis Laos? I'm sorry, Hollywood. I. I can't. I've literally been stabbed by people who stab. Hold on! Beware. The Black Fane. Ugh. He tells me you're slow as molasses. As slow as molasses if you take a lot of turns. <gasps> That's funny. Good to know. I thought I took a lot of turns, but... Apparently not. Meanwhile, deep dramatic plot is happening <laughs> on screen. <laughs> and I'm reading chat like it's no biggie. He's gone. It can't be. Lord Hellman. Why? Why did this happen? Blast! What is going on? I guess we just hung out at his castle and stayed the night? Even though the guy's dead? I don't know. I always get confused by that time skip. Uh, we go to Laos. We must speak to the Marquis of Laos, Lord Darwin. You're right. We should leave quickly. I'm not sure how far we can get today, but... I can't sit still. Pardon me. Hmm? If I may, who are you? I'm the steward of Santa Cruz. So we crashed at this guy's place and you didn't even meet the steward? What? I'm confused. 
Unless they just op literally opened some curtains in the room so they could see better. I don't know. I don't know. With our lord gone, what are we to do? First, you give Lord Helmet a proper burial. After that, I'm sure the Lysian Council will have to meet. Stay here and defend the castle until you hear more. I understand. Let's go. We must keep moving. Yes. And now we seek answers from our quest Santarus, too. Lord Helmet, may you find peace. Oh, it's a side quest. Heck yeah, I accept that side quest. I don't skip side quests. What do you take me for? A non-completionist? The dying words of Lord Hellman stun Elliewood beyond belief. <laughs> Darren, the Marquis of Laos, knows all. Despite the pain it brings, Eliwa takes this newfound knowledge to heart and sets out for Laos once again. This game is all kinds of misspellings. You can't figure out how they want to spell their countries or cities. On the way to Laos, he travels through a K through a Kalen village. Eliwood and his party decide to rest there for a night. Don't worry, Rex. I got the safe state covered. Mostly. The Peddler Merlinus. Yeah, Merlinus. 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 Bah! Dark already. We'll have to stop here for the night. We'll set off for a louse at the first sign of sunlight. Marcus, prepare for the camp. Yes, my lord. So this is Kaelin? You think we ought to present ourselves to Lord Housen? We're simply passing through, so I don't see the need. I am curious about how Lindis is getting along, though. Lindis? Marcus Kaelin's granddaughter. Oh, right! I always forget the places' names. Oh, her. The missing heir dealt with Lundgren last year. Didn't you have something to do with that? Hmm. And? The granddaughter. Is she a beauty? <laughs> a beauty? She's... I don't... She's... I think it must be her CK heritage. She's... <gasps> striking! Striking? Too bad, isn't it? What? That we don't have time to see her, lover boy. No! Lindus and I are... We're not... <laughs> You're not? Then why are you getting so worked up? Hector! Don't make me angry! You know this is not my cannon ship in this game! Ha 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 ha! You are so much fun to tease! Huh? What was that? Did you hear something? It was a scream. Someone's being attacked! Do we help? Of course we help! <laughs> Same bandit as before, I guess. Oh no! Someone help! Grr, stupid old fool. He kept us running in circles for hours. My, my valuable merchandise. What are you going to do? Hey, look at this. The old fool's wealthy. Uh huh. -huh. Our lucky day. Eh? Who's on? Let go! Let go! Will you let go? I... I will not let you go. I... <laughs> he got... <laughs> oh, Jack. Killing me. Killing me, Smalls. What a racket. Who's on? Can we get rid of this simpleton? I suppose so. There's no reason to let him live. Oh my! Yeah! <laughs> My voice was not built for fake screaming. Release him! Who? I told you to let the man go. If you move quickly, we'll let you live. Ha! A pair of dandies like you? You know what I think? Living off your parents' names prancing about. I despise you. 
Come on, don't hold back. We'll kill you all. And this is why we got the torches in the previous chapter. Wait, FE6 suggests that the wife is Fiora? Oh! One of the supports, Marcus, says that Elio went missing for three days to get his wife her favorite flower star from Elia. Ah, uh, that's interesting. I, f I don't know the conversation in context, but I feel like you could make the argument that Ninian and Nils traveled so much around the country that maybe at one point they did stop at Elia because they were constantly on the run from the Black Fane. But... <laughs> and then I don't know what kind of argument you can make for Lynn if you try to make her the wife. Just that she somehow heard about those flowers. But yeah, I could see the strong argument for um, it being Fiora since she's actually from that country. Oh gosh, more fake screaming. Aye! <laughs> you! They call you Nom Nom, am I right? Uh-huh. I am Merlinus, a humble and lily merchant. I know nothing of combat. Please, you must protect me. Okay. So... Matthew! My eyes! Um... Uh, frick. How am I gonna do this? What level are you? Three? Okay, not bad. Um... She showed her the country. Yeah, that's possible too. Uh, oh, swordsman, kind of. Okay. Pew pew. Steppy. Steppy. <laughs> No, you're not taking down the tree. Make the enemy do the work. You are gonna stay there. Oh, right, there is that village up there. I think how I nor- I think normally what I would do is I would just send Merlin- Mar- not Merlin is- Marcus by himself and go all the way up there. But I don't know what I'm gonna do here. I have seven turns. So, I guess we'll figure it out when we get there. Um, I guess you can go there. You can lean out here. I don't know, guys. Sit there for now, I guess. I definitely want you in the middle in case someone needs help. Um, Matthew, hang out with Guy, I guess? There's no one in the immediate area that's a problem, so... Wrath is such a good pairing with Lynn. Agreed. 10 out of 10 would support. Oh no. If I don't go up there, the village is going to be attacked. Eek. 
Yeah, I'll definitely send Marcus up there. Cause I don't really, tr I don't, well, I guess I can trust Loan too, maybe, with going up there. Um, Cause Loan's been pretty darn solid so far. I have had no complaints from him. First though, I'm gonna send Matthew up. So we can see, yep. Gotta keep the green hair alive. Yep. Um. Eep. I saved. It's fine. Eek. <laughs> Ay! Dorcas, nice, nice, nice. Um, Elliot, you are also kind of struggling to kill people. Not as bad as Rebecca, but I might have to start babying you soon. Got this. Oswin's got this. When in doubt, Oswin. doesn't have win in his name for no reason. Oh, frick, they can get up that way too. Frick, 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 frick. Eep. Uh-huh. Do I regret this decision? I don't know. We'll find out. Meanwhile, level up. Okay. As I am just perpetually nervous <laughs> this whole thing. <laughs> okay. Definitely saving. Okay. You. Uh, no, wait. Okay. Okay, you can make it. You're good. You need a break. And a vulnerary. Swordsman. Might have to make Dorcas run away. Ay! Ay! Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. What is it? Oh my, those ruffians are attacking you? Our village is in danger too. We talked it over and here. It's all the money we collected. If you'll chase off the bandits, it's yours. 5,000 gold. Nice. Uh, oh, no, go in the woods. to use guy at all. Close to level ups, but not quite level ups. Uh, I guess we can hang out up here, see if I can get some use out of ya. I doubt it, but we'll see. You can just hang up there. You're good, you're good. Uh, e. Most embarrassing way to die, Rebecca. <laughs> I, I'm so nervous now for Lowen. This is why normally I have Merlinus go, but oh, I, oh, I'm concerned. I am very concerned. Like nicking him, but I don't think he's gonna die next turn. I don't wanna, wanna knock on wood. I don't think he's. Gonna... Oh, never mind. All my hope and hopes and dreams have just crashed with him. Okay. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Do you have? Okay. Go. Get him down for... Oh! Merlinus? Did I make that mistake again? I probably did. I'm sorry. Marcus! <laughs> I normally have Marcus go up there by himself. <laughs> uh. Oh, those are hexes. Nuts and nuts. Just in case, I don't know if she's gonna get suddenly attacked again or not, but it's fine. Uh, you are going to be on the defensive for right now. Yep. Good boy. Good boy. Dorcas will hopefully come to his rescue. If not, I regret everything. Ayy! 
crit? I Please keep that up, Dorcas. Please don't die. And Lowen, please don't die. That would be swell. I'm. <laughs> His health is going down so fast. Uh, okay, you missed that one. I'm so nervous. I just, just have to zip through it. Oh, hey, level up! <laughs> I'll pause for that. Oh! Who's gonna have to do the saving? Dorcas or Lowen? I. Praise a thousand times over here. <laughs> Definitely saving. Cause it seems like even if it goes bad, it's still like a winnable situation. Um Don't let me down, guy. I don't know if I can trust you or not, but don't let me down. Honestly, did not mean to do that. It's fine. Not really worth redoing or anything. I'm just gonna let that happen. <laughs> It's not gonna need a legit heal. Okay. Nothing to be. Oh. I might have spoken too soon. No? Okay. 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 Good. Good, good. Last turn! Oh! Praise the Lord! This was a little more difficult than I realized. Eh, can't fight back. You'd be, uh, a stuck. Guy! Guy! What the f flip, man? I'm probably gonna regret this decision, but we'll see. We'll just play it out. I saved. I'm not concerned. No. Oh, you have 100% hit. And you got a crit. Just to make me feel better. I don't, you know what? Just in case. I'm going to put him there. I'm still. I'm going to give you a heal. You never know. If some archer is gonna come out of nowhere and be like, Hi, I'm here to ruin your day. Uh, 
Uh, I still have the energy and rain, yes. I think Dorcas was carrying it. Who's carrying it? Dorcas, yeah. That was the last turn. I didn't need to do anything. Wooch. Oof. Blast. I won't forget this. And you're smarter than you look. Get out of here. Are you alright? Hmm? Oh, oh, I... I've been saved. We've driven them off. Are you injured? No, not at all. As you can see, I'm as fine as fine can be. I even could have gone to that village for you instead of that Marcus doofus or whoever you were trying to say earlier. <laughs> I'm glad to see that. We'll take our leave then. Let's go, Hector. Wait a moment, please. A token of my thanks. Do not worry yourself. We did nothing to merit reward. That's right. We have no need of a peddler's junk. Oof. Hector. Peddler? Hector! Oops. Ahem. <clears throat> I am Merlinus. You'll find no other traveling merchant whose goods compare. Don't let your eyes fool you. I'm quite prosperous. Huh? You're a merchant? Books and knives and all that, eh? Hector, your manners are terrible. Merlinus, please. Pay no mind to what this oaf has to say. No, of course not. I wasn't concerned at... <clears throat> By the way, you two obviously come from highborn houses. Would you grant me the honor of your names? I am Eliwood, son of the Marquess of Frey. I'm Hector, Marquess Ostia's brother. Goodness! Ostia? Frey? The greatest houses in all of Lycia! Ah, uh, to be saved by noblemen such as yourselves. It is an honor beyond words. It's nice to be appreciated for a change. Lately, people just seem to want us dead. <laughs> Tell me, Merlinus, what are your plans? Pardon? My plans, my lord. I had planned to travel Elysia selling my merchandise, but it may not be possible in such dangerous times. If that's the case, why don't you come along with us? Hector? Our travels will not be ending anytime soon. We've gained more people and more items, right? It might be good to have help managing our things. Finally! A convoy! Oh! Praise! Oh ho! Now that is a splendid idea. Managing merchandise is my specialty, after all. Are you sure? Quite sure, my lord. To be honest, I've dreamt of working for a noble house. To have my fondest wish granted in such a way? I cannot stem these tears of joy. Lord Hector, Lord Eliwood, take me into your bosoms and keep me safe forever. <laughs> uh, thank you. Well, Merlinus, we're counting on you. Now, I've got some things I want you to carry. <laughs> yes, of course, whatever you have, Merlinus will keep. A save. Okay, I am actually going to stop that for now. <laughs> yeah, alright, so that was a good run, but I'm going to end it there for now. Um, yeah, um, that was a lot of fun. It was so fun to chat with people too. All that it, that always makes my Twitch experience so much better when it, people are actually talking and interacting. It just makes it just makes it go by so much faster. Like I can't even believe I've been streaming for almost three hours now. Normally I'm like counting down to like when it's been like two hours, but that was just such a fun experience. Um, I I think I'll be streaming later tonight. I'm not sure. 
Um, but, yeah, I definitely know I do want to stream tonight. I don't know what time. Maybe after, like, dinner time or something. Um, I'll probably either come back to this game or I might play a different game just to freshen things up. But, yeah. You are welcome, Rex. It was fun. I definitely thought it was fun. <laughs> um, anyway. Enough for chit chat. Uh, goodbye. I hope to see you all real soon. Adios.